Come on, Pablo. It's okay. Come on, Pablo. Yeah. Hello, everyone. Um, just a quick uh, little milestone, a very advanced milestone, and a very uh, sort of unusual milestone within the life planner. I strongly um, do not advise attempting this unless if you are confident in yourself and have enough practice and also enough um, resilience strength. and strength and also when yourself is personally ready to attempt this milestone. But this is what I've discovered after many, many months of practicing and it's walking, with, and it's walking without the belt applied. Is without the belt, and also as well, um, I I have mentally trained my brain to say everything is okay. It's similar to walking in a walking thing, really, but obviously with uh, some minor differences. But there's no strain or no pain and no depletion of stamina. But again, it takes a lot of practice, a lot of time, a lot of effort, and a lot of confidence, resilience. But I strongly do recommend that you do try this at your own risk and when you're personally on this milestone if if you I mean, if you're not ready. Uh, at the end of the day it's up to you if if you want to attempt this. But at the end of the day, like I've said, it's up to you and it's up to you alone. Thank you very much for watching. I'm just gonna walk to you. To the front of the camera. Bye bye and have a good day. Uh, currently in the life player once again, uh, discovering something brand new, playing uh, playing the PlayStation for the first time, playing some Rayman Legends. Um, basically, my life glider is um, currently in its brute position. I go, oh, yeah, but my um, life glider is in the brake position and I am playing uh, a game. For the first time standing up with no issues um, there's no pain no pain or stamina depletion and overall I'm just surprised that this is actually possible I'm feeling no urges to, to go forward because I'm mentally training my brain to say that it, to say that everything's okay it's all safe and there's no need to be alarmed so I'm, I'm learning to train my brain once again whilst in Pretty little milestone in the life player. Very straightforward. Uh, getting uh, cut away. You need a spoon and I need spoon. a fork. You need a, do a spoon and or a fork. Yeah. You got a spoon and fork. Now I'm just going to do the move back. Very quick video on how to lay the table. There you go. Bye. Hello, um, hello everyone. Welcome to uh, a milestone within the life planner. I hope the perspective is very uh, easy to see. Uh, we're going in the freezer today. Fridge. Fridge today. To uh, try and get some drink. Just turn. Look, it turns up. There we go. And there's two ways to make doing this. You can do it with the belt. No, well, not with the belt. You can do it with the brake active or put the brake on 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 don't go anywhere but um we're just going to grab some drinks what do, what, do you, what do you want do you want a coke or do you want that or that's rubicon do you want to go for some rubicon that's it then and um the what do you want for that? I don't know yet. Alright. Well, 
That's it then, then I've got my drink in my right hand. Just gonna turn it around. Now, from the previous responses, I forgot to show you um, the potatoes when I was chopping up the potatoes. But this is the drink I've got, Rubicon. Oh, hang on, wrong way. That's alright. Rupert Kahn. That's not the wrong way. Is it not the wrong way? Oh yeah. That's the right way. Yeah, we got some Rupert we're going to put the Rupert on, on the table. On the table. And... That's it, huh? Yeah. Jobs are good, huh? That's it. Um, any feedback regarding the new perspective for this video or anything is welcome. Any feedback for future milestones will be considered and and uh, potentially implement, um, implemented in future videos. So thank you for watching and stay tuned. Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. In this video, I'm going, I'm going to show you um, something uh, which, is in, which is completely incredible um, in the life quarter. Just give me a second. So I'm over by my dining room table and <clears throat> it's one of those fold unfold style dining tables and I'm going to show you um, how to un and how I unfold the table in the life glider. So I used to do this in the walking frame and unfortunately I didn't video it back when I had my I'm, I'm wearing the walking frame, but it's a very simple process. And I'm going to talk, I'm going to give you like a mini walk through uh, detailed, detailed um, process on, on how I was able to do this. So to make it easier for yourself, I recommend putting the brake on. And then you reach out, bring it up. Oh no. Hang on, no, actually, no. I'm putting the brake on. The reason why I say put the brake on is because you will go back whilst and whilst this little bit is going going um, forward, and then I think I have to go a bit forward again. <laughs> Sorry, I have to go a bit forward again, and then you just do this. And then basically there's a little mechanism on the on the bottom part of this where you just basically bring it out like that and the table is now if you can see unfolded. Hello everyone, welcome to today's video. In today's life glider video, I'm going to show you um, something that I discovered um, yesterday, which is uh, which is lifting some weights in the life glider. So this weight is a one kilogram, so it's pretty small. Um, but yesterday I was able to uh, lift up to five kilograms. Um, similar to this, which is like a mini dumbbell type thing, I don't know what it is, but basically this is me lifting up the dumbbell like this, I'm switch over to my right hand and do this, I'm gonna switch over I'm going to switch over to my left hand, just put the brake on because I wasn't playing the safe game unfortunately. So yeah, I forgot to put my brake on, sorry. But yeah, this is me lifting weights. Um, my seatbelt is still on, it's, I'm, it's on the, I'm it's on a bit of a tightness setting and I'm just lifting weights, doing stuff like this. Whilst in the life blader. And because I've got to not worry about stability and balance, because that's all handled by the belt, I can just freely move 
my hand in any direction with the dumbbell to try and get some um, weight and try and get some pressure built up in my arm. So I was in the left, and I was in the left. Let's try it on the right. So as you can see, I'm not really utilizing my left hand for stability because it's all handled by the belt, like I previously said. The belt is on minimum to maximum tightness. I'm just doing this with this, and I'm also gonna be doing a bit of this as well, lifting up with both hands together. <laughs> and that's that. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. I am gonna do a follow-up video in the, um, in the future, which is gonna um, have me potentially lift up to five kilograms um of weight similar to this mini dumbbell type thing so i hope you enjoyed this video please stay tuned for future uh, life guider milestones tutorials safety tips um, updates and future news and information thank you very much Kick it, man. Kick it. Oh, this is not good, isn't it? <laughs> we don't feel very good at this. Kick it. Push it out. Push it out. Mm -hmm. There you go. Ooh. <laughs>